what's up you guys welcome back to the vlog today i just want to update you guys on what's coming next to my channel what to expect next month and the upcoming videos so today is tuesday february 20th it's tuesday so y'all know what that means today tonight is launch fly talk for those of you that don't know what launch fly talk is it's a show that me and my besties go on live on youtube and we talk about all things launch fly we don't just talk about launch fly we talk about all the bags like shop harvey's dooney and burke um what else dooney and burke hot topic launch wise we talk about all things bags <laughs> But it's over on my besties channel, Danielle's Bio Adventure. We have a blast every single time we do this. I just like letting you guys know so we have new people every single time watching us and joining the comments. Let us know what you guys are using, um, what you guys bought, what you guys loved from this past catalog. If anybody bought anything from March catalog, please let me know. I'm really interested to know if anybody pre-ordered anything. I just wanted to do a quick update because I know I haven't really been doing updates on what's been going on and what has my life been <laughs> so i recently just got a camera and i'm so so freaking excited and happy about that about time i got a camera you know it was getting annoying that my iphone kept running out of storage and i use my phone a lot so i really hated that it was really annoying and i recently got a computer too which i need to show you guys my computer so this is my new laptop and it's an hp laptop Y'all, I don't know anything about electronics. I know I just needed a laptop for my stuff. I like how the buttons have lights. Bougie. I really love, love, love this laptop. Um, It bends all the way. So you can also use it as a tablet. Super cool. And you can bend it back or use it like this too. You can place it down and use it this way. Or just bend it all the way back and use it as a laptop i really love this laptop it gets the job done um i do wish i got a macbook maybe i will end up getting a macbook pretty soon just depends if i do get a macbook i want the i forgot the name of the macbook i'm not gonna lie oh yeah so if i were to get a macbook i want the m2 the m2 chip because i've been seeing good reviews on that one i know the screen's slightly bigger um which I would love that. I ignore my hair, you guys. I'm barely getting ready. But as for my camera, I got the Osmo Pocket 3. This tiny thing is amazing. I love it so, so much. You can actually unattach it, the bottom part, and just use it as one small thing. Or attach the bottom part. And use the little tripod at the bottom. I still don't know how to use it all the way. <laughs> which I need to start using it more often. But it's not heavy at all and it sounds amazing. So happy that I got a vlogging camera finally. Let me finish getting ready and then tell you guys more of my next upcoming videos. Which I'm very, I don't know why I didn't move the camera. Which I'm very excited about. I don't know what to do with this lion hair of mine all puffed up this is my natural hair you guys it's not naturally straight it's a natural mess <laughs> anyways it's getting pretty dark in my room there was sunlight all of a sudden there's nothing but clouds okay so I did get a lot of questions on like my lashes they're from Sheen Boo only for a dollar and ninety they come in one two three three pairs yeah so three pairs of lashes in each 
I love these lashes, but when I received them, I received them very hairy and weird. So what I do is I stick them on this plastic thing that it comes with this plastic thing right here i stick one on right here and i start just brushing them and cutting the long hairs off so that way they don't look crazy when they're on my eyes because a bunch of hairs are going different directions and i do not like that you guys i have not had time to do anything i just realized i still have all my valentine's day stuff up I need to move some of the Valentine's Day stuff and move some bags around. I need to do some organizing around my room, which I have not. I don't know if I should strain or curl my hair. Maybe curl my hair because it's not much of a hassle. Not curl it, but like give it a little twist and, and brush. If you guys don't have one of these, get yourself one of these. I got mine from TikTok shop and I believe it's only sold on TikTok shop this thing is amazing it will change your life it does your hair so fast and it's a wavy talk wavy talk best thing i've purchased on tiktok shop they have a bunch of good stuff like this glitter lip gloss i bought the other day the glitter on this thing is insane anyways i do have a couple trips planned um me and my husband have been talking about going back to collecticon this year and we decided to attend collecticon again but we want to go to the one in orlando it will be may 25th i believe it's on a weekend on a saturday i can't believe we're going back i'm super excited especially because i believe this year it should be bigger in orlando can't wait to see how collecticon is this year another trip that we want to take as well is go back to halloween Horror Nights this year i cannot wait to see what hhn has this year hopefully we see five nights at freddy's ghostbusters beetlejuice please bring beetlejuice back did y'all see the new beetlejuice movie coming out From my, hair. my hair came out so good don't forget launch fly talk is tonight over at daniel's bio adventures channel live on youtube and also this thursday you guys i will be going to hobby lobby and showing you guys everything i use to make my stony clover dupes i get my patches and pouches there and i'm also showing you guys what rhinestones i use for my launch fly bags so a cute little diy video Has anybody noticed that I put launch flies on top of the door now? They're starting to take over my husband's side of the collecting room. <laughs> That's my husband's side, and this entire side is mine. I have more at the top. This whole thing is mine. There's some behind me and in the corner. Did y'all notice this too? Let me zoom into him. I just bought him from Box Lunch. I had went the first time and seen him, but I did not buy him. I just recently went back and bought him. And it's not a launch fly. It's a Her Universe. But he's super cute.
realize I don't have that much Easter stuff. I really need to go find some more decor. But all these are from last year. There's a new Stitch Squishmallow coming. I got this one too last year. You guys will be able to see everything. Time gets closer because we're barely going to be in March. One more week of Feb and that's it. This one's so cute. This one's my favorite. I found this one at Claire's. And it says peeps on the back. Bye V-Day stuff. Till next year. I don't think I showed y'all this yet, but I found the Hello Kitty chair from Impressions Vanity on Valentine's Day and my hubby bought it for me. Here she is. She came home to me. Oh my god. I still cannot believe she's in my room. I love Hello Kitty Impressions vanity stuff. It's just the cutest. And it's very comfortable, you guys. I love sitting on this. It's so big, too. Super pretty. Only for $130 at TJ Maxx. Okay y'all, so I made it to Hobby Lobby and I'm in the patches area. So these are the patches that I use for my pouches. They are so cute, they have so many. This is where I got my J from and these already have glue on the back. So you don't have to put more glue on the back on these. If you want to, you can, but it is totally up to you. These are the bigger letters up here. They have Hello Kitty. They have Barbie. I love the Disney ones. And over here they have more. But with these, you do need glue for these. I love these. I don't know which one to get. Probably squirt. So for these you need glue and I use the E6000 and it works perfect. And this is where the pouches are, you guys. They have different types. They have a clear black one. This is the one I already have. They even have pink ones. And bigger ones, but they're clear on both sides. I don't know which one to get, but I am using this patch to show you guys how to put them on. So I'll just get this black clear one. I think it's cute. And then for those of you asking where I get my rhinestones for my launch fly bags, I use these right here. They are super sparkly too and different <laughs> sizes. I love these and they're on sale right now, some of them. They have pink, orange, blue, green, pink. This pink is nice. And this one too. This one's cute. Today is currently Sunday, February 25th. You guys, two days ago, I went to Hobby Lobby. <laughs> so those videos that y'all just saw were filmed two days ago. I had family that came over this weekend and today I woke up feeling sick. I'm losing my voice, my throat really hurts. So I really don't know if I will be recording 
this whole week i'll update you guys if anything but i'm pretty sure i might end up losing my voice my throat really really hurts anyways i have to finish this vlog off and i am finishing by showing y'all how to put the patch on the patch i did end up buying the snoopy patch and I ended up buying the black pouch. I usually like the clear ones because I can see what I have in it. I believe for this pouch you need glue. Let me check. Yeah. So there is no glue on the back of this one. It's not sticky at all. You're going to need the glue, which is the E6000. So these two, the glue and the clothing iron. Let me go get them. And I'm going to go ahead and have my husband iron it on for me. Oh, and then you also need like a piece of clo uh, clothing or cloth to put over the patch. So you guys don't burn the patch. Um... I usually use a towel. The towel will go over the patch and you hold it, I think, for like 20 seconds or 25 seconds. Check the patch and if the patch is not on right or on correctly or anything like that or it needs more glue, then go ahead and add more. Just lift it up a little bit on the corners that it needs it and then again do the same thing another 20 25 seconds with the towel over it and it will be stuck on just like this. That was it for this vlog. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Please give a thumbs up on this video. Subscribe to my channel. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye!